In 2011, with funding from the New York City Department of Cultural Affairs through the Brooklyn Arts Council, I created an embroidered portrait of love in the borough. And the process for doing that was interactive and also collaborative. Um, you see me here at the 2011 Dumbo Arts Festival, where I was making my Brooklyn love map, collecting stories to fill in gaps for neighborhoods like Seagate and Coney Island, where I don't really know anyone. I was hoping to meet people, new people, who were outside of my normal circle of friends and was moved and surprised by the generosity both of friends who visited and looked forward to seeing me and also of strangers who trusted me, who sat down and shared really heartfelt memories. People came as couples to tell me stories. They came individually to share stories about meeting online, which, you know, it's something a lot of us have tried. I remember couples who met at the dog run. One resisted the other until magically they fell in love. There are all kinds of stories and I alternated between embroidering on site on the map itself as you saw earlier and sitting and taking notes as I'm doing here. Um, both served as records for me of the collaboration as well as this footage, the video footage, which was taken by my good friend Luke Hurlbeck. Um, and he became my collaborator as well as a result of this project. Um, I'm pictured here with a friend who shared with me the story of how she and her then boyfriend got together. And even though I knew them both pretty well, I had never heard the whole story. So this whole project gave me an opportunity to really not only connect with people I didn't know, but connect with people I knew well in a new and more nuanced and more intimate manner. One of my favorite stories from this experience was of this really beautiful Asian couple who met when they were 13 years old and didn't date at that time because they were too young. They really didn't date anyone, in fact, at that time. They became good friends and eventually in college after two years started dating um, what happened was the man in the story gave the woman three dolls after their first college year to signify that he was willing to wait three more years to be with her and she got an associate's degree after two years and then a bachelor's and they eventually they got married and it's now their seventh wedding anniversary and I feel so honored that I was able to meet them at the Dumbo Arts Festival and to share in their joy and to get this current update from them. So our relationship extended beyond this ephemeral fe festival. It continues today and into the making of this film. I went back to the couple and got an update just so I could make this footage as current as possible. Thank you.